Hello welcome to Irish Football Fan TV. This is the starting 11 show. Republic of Ireland versus Hungary in the friendly in the Aviva. I'm going to start with Cuevin Kelleher in goal. I think he's the best choice available. Had such a strong season with Liverpool and showed what he can do when he's given first team football. At the moment he would be Ireland's number one. Um, he continued to play the games in the last international break under John O'Shea so it seems to me that he is the number one right now and it's his spot to lose. Unfortunately for Gavin Bazoon who's obviously out injured but Cuevin Kelleher for me in there as number one. I'm going to go with a back three on this occasion and I think bringing in Dara O'Shea in there um, albeit he's young he's still quite experienced and I think he would bring a lot of experience to this back three when you've got Jake O'Brien who I'd like to see start next to him and then alongside him to provide balance along the back three then uh, is for scales to go on that left hand side or back three provide a natural balance across the back three and I think if you have Jake O'Brien sitting in the middle there he can start attacks from the middle and you've got O'Shea and you've got scales on either side of him which, uh, which gives us a, a nice balance, I think, going forward. And then in the wing-back positions, I'm going to go with Seamus Coleman, who was brilliant last time out in the last international break. And I think um, he'll show his, I suppose, ability and his uh, presence and experience in this squad because it is quite a silly young squad there, um, that most, the majority of them. I think that Seamus obviously brings so much and is still you know, our top-performing uh, player in the Premier League. And has been for so long, albeit he's coming to the end of his days. I still think Seamus is one of our better players. And obviously what he brings in terms of on and off the pitch to the team. Everybody has spoken about it from the managers right through to the players. So I think him there, Robbie Brady, I think just on the left-hand side. I would have gone with Matt Doherty, but I do think if we're thinking set-piece deliveries and getting players like Jacob Bryan and Liam Scales and Darrow Shea in the box and trying to get their head on things, I do think it's key that we have a really good person that can deliver the ball but also have three big giant center backs that can you know attack the ball and get them so that would be where i go with robbie brady very good on the ball good at keeping the ball as well very good in possession so i think he would suit well in this system and then you've got a midfield three i'd go with josh cullen will smallbone and jason knight i think um cullen to be the one who receives off the defenders on the half turn and gets the attacks going and then in front of him you've got smallbone who has the technical ability to be able to slip through passes and get on the ball and try and make things happen in the final third. And I think Jason Knight has a bit of that as well. He's a finisher and uh, he provides a lot of energy in the midfield, like getting around and covering spaces and pressing space and players. And I think that that's where I would go with those three again, just to give it that fine balance in the middle. And then up front, I go with a two with Sammy Smonix just in behind Adam Ida. And look, if he, if he comes ahead of him, great. It just means that if Adam Ida is dropping deep for for balls that uh, need to be held up it means that Ida can come in drop it off pop it off and maybe Smodrix can even get in behind uh, and start getting use of uh, our players in the final third look we've got players to come off the bench there like Troy Parrott we've got Mikey Johnson we've got other players to come in there who can probably make a change and look I'd be open to suggestions if anyone has any other players that they'd like to see come in there but that's been my 11 let me know what you think in the comments I'll speak to you all soon enjoy the game come on you boys in green